What good do their dams also do for the surrounding ecosystems? Well, if you have those wet valley bottoms, um, they, there's a couple things that are involved. One is that it's creating a different environment than the uplands. Uh, so it's increasing habitat diversity, and you get a, a different variety of plants and animals and insects and fish and pretty much everything scientists have looked at that are able to live in those wet valley bottoms. The beaver uh, also, of course, are, are constantly moving uh, across the valley bottom. They'll build a dam. It'll, the pond will gradually fill with sediment. They'll build a new dam and move somewhere else. So they're creating diverse habitats within that wet valley bottom. And in looking at the ecological literature, one of the things that's impressed me is pretty much every species that scientists have looked at, from bacteria to insects, fish, birds, reptiles, amphibians, mammals, a wide variety of plants, they find a much greater diversity of species in these wet valley bottoms that are sometimes called beaver meadows. Ellen Wolf, Professor of Geology at Warner College of Natural Resources at Colorado State University. Created using Powtoon.